Okay. No. Get away from me. Get away from me. Okay, we go. Jesus Almighty man. Thank you, my Lord. You live it. Thank you. Hello? Santa? How are you? You're okay? Yeah. You have tattoo on yours? Mm -hmm. Oh, let me see the tattoo. Mm -hmm. What means that tattoo in your body? It's just colorful. Huh? It's just decorations. Decoration in your body, Jesus is the decorate your, your life also already. That because that thinks it's Satan devices, but you can move that. Don't worry, okay? Okay? You love the Lord and Jesus wants to change your life. No more outside children. I'm seeing you in the level to come back when Jesus visits your heart, okay? Thank you that you came here. Welcome to the Prayer Land of Liberty. Please tell us why you're here today and the experience you had on the Prayer Land. Um, yes, I'm here because I, um, I've just been seeking the um, face of God, um, just wanting to have a, a more intimate experience with God, um, well, Lord Jesus. And um, I been seeking for a place like this that offers real live uh, deliverance and um, I found that here. Can you tell us a little bit about your experience on the prayer line? There was a manifestation. Do you um, remember I, that? Yeah, and I was kind of um, embarrassed because I wasn't um, l expecting that. Um, so it was a little bit embarrassing for me. Um, but it's not really embarrassing because it's all for the glory of the, of the Most High God. Amen. And how do you feel now? Honestly, I had bad back pain because I had um, a pelvic fracture. But I do know that um, I wasn't looking for like uh, re relief from my back pain, but I do. I have relief from my back pain. That's gone. Amen. And what is your promise to Jesus now? So my promise to Jesus is to live, try to live my best, more righteously, um, be kind to people, try not to take offense. Um, it's one thing to be offended, but it's another thing to harbor offense. And I feel like um, a lot of our issues, a lot of our problems come from um, us harboring pain of the past, um, offense, and um, just negative things that have happened to us. It's better to just, you know, it, we don't necessarily have to accept it, but you know, it happens and forgive it and release the people, you know, that way you can be released. Amen. I stand with you in agreement in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen.